Good evening and welcome to IBA News coming to you from Jerusalem. And joining us now in the studio to talk about the GA is Mark Wilf, Vice Chairman of the UJC's Board of Directors and one of the chairs of this year's GA. Welcome, Mark. Good to have you with us. Thank you for having me. Uh, of course, attendance is way down this year compared to, say, five years ago, and I, we all assume it's because of the, the economic crisis that's affecting not only the United States but the whole world. Uh, are you worried about donations uh, declining dramatically with the UJC? Well, uh, you know, first of all, our attendance, we're, we're, we're excited about the fact that we have nearly 4,000 people here from all over North America uh, coming to Israel. So given the whole year of celebrating Israel's 60th, we're very, uh, feeling very fortunate about the attendance. And as far as the economy, yes, we're concerned that it's tough economic times, but it's precisely the type of times where a safety net of UJC and Federation is that important. And in fact, uh, we just concluded our international line of Judah conference, uh, women from all over the world, over a thousand of them in Tel Aviv, and giving was up over 13 percent. They raised 16 million dollars. So people understand, even in these economic times, and even more so, we need the safety net Federation provides. Well, it's particularly impressive because one would think that it's only natural that American Jews, North American, Canadian, or from the United States, would tend to help their own communities first in times of crisis and then withhold some of those funds, however reluctantly, from Israel. Well, that's something very important that, that we believe strongly in the Federation system is that we're one worldwide Jewish community. And whether it's a, a, a child in, in, in Ramat Gan or uh, uh, an elderly person in Cleveland, we're all one Jewish community. And I think people understand that, and that's part of what we're going to do with the GA is educate each other and get to know each other better and understand that every dollar raises for all of us. So I'm, I'm hopeful that the giving will be strong for everybody. Well, as, besides, uh, aside from the economic distractions, what else is on the agenda at this year's at GA? Well, we're going to be uh, uh, reaching out to the entire uh, country of Israel. We're going to over 60 sites, uh, visiting different institutions that we work closely with. Uh, we're particularly excited this year for the first time We've had 900 next generation young leadership having a full day program today, which just is concluding, and we're very excited about that. So a lot of good things on the agenda, and we're, we're feeling good. Mark, I'd like to talk about something else entirely. We understand you are the owner and the president of the Minnesota Vikings, which are right now in uh, first place in NFL. There's a lot of interest in American football here in Israel. In fact, there's a new tackle league football that's a uh, league that is backed by Myra and uh, Robert Kraft. Any chance that you might get involved in the actions over here in Israel? Well, I, I'll tell you what, uh, when we win that Vince Lombardi trophy, which is the, uh, the NFL trophy, we'll be happy to bring it over here and celebrate with our brothers and sisters in Israel. And we look forward to that day. And we're, we're excited about the product of American football. And we know the Israel Football League is doing a great job and uh, look forward to being part of that one day, too. Well, since uh, Brett Favre has been stolen away by the Jets, I'm going to switch my loyalties from the Packers to the Vikings <laughs> this year. Well, thank you. Every fan counts. We appreciate the support. Okay, Mark Wolf of the UJC Board of Directors, also a chair of this year's <coughs> GA and owner of the Minnesota Vikings. Thanks so much for joining us in IBA. Thank you. That's all for today. We'll be back tomorrow, same time, same channel. Until then, thanks for watching and shalom from Jerusalem.